if you are saved, you can pray for her. But some of one, number one, going to be in number two. Now, if you if you love the Lord yourself, you can pray for her. And if you want a church, you can talk church to her. If you ever read your Bible, you can tell her what the Bible says. Because the Bible says he that finds a wife finds a good thing. So you want to really know that she is she believes in God. Because some people don't even believe in God. So you don't want to get her from a family like that. Because then you really going to have problems. If you don't want to go to church, she's not going to want to go. That There's a problem right there. Find out if she went to church. Find out how does she really love the Lord. You can ask those questions. You ain't got to be saved to ask that. You just want to know what's, what, how she's feeling. Do you do you know in uh, in your voice? Do you know the ten? Can you recite the ten commandments? No. I can tell you the king. Yeah, uh, what's another one? The Lord gave a woman. The Proverbs is your book for women. I said, do you ever read the book of Proverbs? Have you ever read? And I just leave it just like that. See what she got to say about Proverbs, because she's talking about a woman in there. She should have read it. She'll see how to live, make a good wife. Okay. Well, number two is pretty much covered itself. So if you pray and you study and you sit down and talk to her, you'll soon find out that she's in the Bible, that she was raised in the church. That's a, a short one. Pray for her and ask others that you know, your grandmother, uh, your, uh, your aunts, and your, uh, uh, your uncles that you know say, so pray for her. I kind of like her, but I don't know what to say to her. And then, uh, then you go from there.